Hello people, welcome back to the channel and today we are unboxing my favourite Beyblade, Geist of Fafnir. Um, this is owned by Free de la Hoya in the Trozy series. It does get destroyed at the end of the Trozy series by Dead Phoenix. Um, because Free tries to teach him the proper way how to Beyblade and all the rest of it. But it gets destroyed by this little blighter here and it does, does destroy got does destroy Guy Fafnir. Um, this is the spin stealing king in terms of spin stealing. There's not really a blade that's better. Wizard Fafnir is good, but it bursts way too often. And it's not actually as good as Guy Fafnir. Guy Fafnir surpassed. This probably should have been the GT version of that version of the bay. So yeah, um, let's get straight into unboxing. I've already got everything out. I've already assembled the Beyblade because otherwise it's quite a pain in the bum trying to get all this out. So that's the launcher. This is the tiny, tiny little rip cord it comes with. It's like four inches long. So that just shows you you don't need a powerful launcher for this bay because it is crazy, crazy good. It's been stealing. This is the Beyblade. So you've got the, uh, the let's pull this the specs up for this Beyblade quickly. So I can't remember for the life of me what it's called, the driver. Right. Okay, guys, Fafnir. So it comes with the energy layer, guys, Fafnir, which is obviously that part there, and it comes with um, comes with the uh, there we go. So yeah, the energy layer is guys, Fafnir, and then you've got the um, performance tip, which is absorb. So the way this performance tip works, you see those teeth there. They merge together. Once it's, when it's launched hard, it goes into a really aggressive state. It clamps down, just like in the anime. This Beyblade works exactly how it does in the anime, which is a really crazy part because obviously it's really hard to do that to replicate that in real life. These dragon heads tuck in once it's spinning fast, and then they come out again to absorb all the attacks, so they can spin still. I've just tried it in the stadium, and it does work. You literally can hand launch this thing against the right spin Beyblade, and it will spin it still and win. Um, so yeah, the forged disc is eight, but obviously you need the underlayer from the um, left left launcher um, left launcher set and it comes with the green absorber ring which is obviously the whole, the whole Beyblade comes with originally you can see it there on the advertisement but it's a bit of a well it's a bit of a not a scam but it's a way to make more money off you to buy the launcher to buy a freeze launcher setup and then you can have the complete Geist Fafnir which is awesome but yeah um, this is my favourite Beyblade, even past GT series. I mean, it's just such a cool thing. It's a cool design. I'm super excited for Mirage, Mirage Fafnir now. Now I've got the announcement, and it's going to be another free bay. Because Wizard Fafnir, I feel like, let the whole series down. It really didn't urge me to buy it. But just the fact that I watched a video, and it was this against um, Wizard Fafnir, and this destroyed it like 17.5. So it just goes to show you how good this is for its time. So yeah, um, I'll put the stickers on guys, and then I'll be back with you in a sec. Hello guys, and we are back, and here is Guys Fafnir with the stickers on. I don't know if you can see them tiny little stickers there, but they took me about an hour to get them on properly, because like, I've got OCD, I've got them looking symmetrical, and it took me forever, forever to get them on perfectly. I had to use tweezers to get them in, I had to use tweezers to get those in up there, but yeah, completely worth it it's probably my favorite baby blade to date until i get my raj fafnir i have pre-ordered that so that it will be on the way and yeah um so let's get into the stats well the stats the what this Beyblade's made of it's got the um, obviously got the guys fafnir attack ring with these rubber heads dragon heads that um come out when it's low on spin and obviously tuck in when it's got high velocity um, it's got the 8 forged disc and it's got proof as the disc frame. Currently this isn't proof, this is cross. Um, but the, the uh, proof disc frame which comes with the launcher set is on the way so we will have a complete Fafnir just like in the anime and we will be able to test it against all the other Trezzy Beyblades that are on the way. And obviously you've got performance tip absorb. Now this thing is a really cool, awesome, weird, bizarre thing. So it's a free spinning tip with like a stamina sharp in the middle but it does if you launch it hard enough it this will clamp down just like in the anime and it'll move crazy it's super hard to control once it goes into its attack mode using those teeth and then obviously when it comes out it'll just go into a stamina type and absorb any right spin hits it comes across 
Um, I'll maybe I'll throw in a clip of it doing a hand spin, a hand spin spin steal where it literally just you can launch it with your hand, and I shit you not, it will just steal the spin of any right spin Beyblade. It's a really cool thing. Obviously, Wizard Fafnir can do the same, but I haven't bought Wizard Fafnir mainly on the base that I've bought Mirage Fafnir, which is obviously going to be better probably. I will order Wizard Fafnir eventually, but just not yet. Until this COVID-19 stuff's over, I want to get it at a decent price and just wait and then wait for the shipping to be back to normal. And yeah, and um, this has been got this is guys Fafnir and it is a wicked, wicked thing. If you haven't picked it up already, pick it up. It's only about eleven pounds on eBay, so it's super cheap, and it's definitely worth the money. And yeah, and I hope you enjoyed today's unboxing, guys. This is guys Fafnir. Expect some battles with it in the future. They'll all be coming on the channel. It's just finding the time to do it all. And yeah, and yeah, I'll talk to you soon, guys, and see you later.